All right, we're outside the 2007 Jag travel trailer. I want to give you as, as close to an in-depth look at it as we possibly can. Looking up front here, we'll notice the decals are all in shiny shape. Um, no apparent body damage that I can see. A couple of just small rock holes, which you'll have um, driving home from the first day it was sold. So uh, twin 30-pound tanks. Those will be full with the deluxe prep. There'll be a brand new 12-volt battery put on. Um, the tongue will be repainted up here as well, so that'll look sharp. Looking at the slide out here, again, we do have the slide out cover over it. That's about an $800 option that the customer added before he traded it. Storage compartment, your freshwater fill is right there. What's nice is the nice diamond plate up front as well, so that'll help with the small stone pebbles that'll fly up from the road as well. Looking down the side of the camper here, we'll notice very large awning. Covers the vast majority of the body here. Again, decals are in nice shape. Other side of the storage there. We'll notice three nice big steps to get into the camper to make it easy. Two bunk windows there. Another storage compartment on the side there as well. Again, the awning will all be inspected and, and if anything's broken on it, that'll get fixed as well. Body looks to be in great shape. Wheels are in nice shiny shape as well. Again, if the tires need to be replaced, we will replace them for you in our prep. You do have a nice, um, they call it a mug dauber. Uh, just a nice little vent cover for the exhaust for the furnace so that critters can't get inside there and make nests, which happened a lot in the RV world, so that protects you there. A little more outside storage here underneath that bottom bunk inside. Quick look at the bunk windows. Alright, let's go inside here. The outside looks to be very nice, so I'm not worried about anything on the outside. Um, let's go in here and see what we've got. Just gotta find the right key. Okay, nice big couch here. That's a jackknife sleeper sofa, so that will fold down flat. Booth dinette, fit a family of four very comfortably, and that folds down to a bed as well. We'll notice the slide out. I'm going to try to cover here that wallpaper issue I was telling you about. So again, your wallpaper there. We'll do as much as we can to reset that. Again, it's just cosmetic. I'm pushing. It's very, very hard. So structurally, we're good. Just to make sure you know. Little indentments in the roof paneling there. Again, I'm putting all my weight on it. Very sturdy, so it's just cosmetic. Quick look at the kitchen. Kitchen's in very nice shape. Stove is very clean. Fridge looks good. Lots of storage. Entertainment center here. Storage. Spot for a TV. Foot flush toilet. Nice four bunk set up in the back here. Get no apparent damage that I see back here as well. I'll give you a quick look at the roof. Floor is very sturdy here in the back, so there's no floor issues. Again, let's have you get a quick look at it. Again, it looks like this wallpaper just got wet. Again, we'll do as much as we can to, to fix that issue if possible in terms of making it look a little bit better. Uh, there's no guarantees as to what it will look like, but we will try our best. Again, it's just very noticeable right now, but we'll try to at least make sure that it's stapled back in so that it's not kind of flake in there. So, a really nice value, especially at the nice sale price we're giving you.
Nice big six cubic foot refrigerator. That's gas and electric. So hopefully this gives you a good close-up view of what the trailer looks like.